Hi guys, welcome to the Let's Design channel. In this video, I will show you how to make this exercise. And this exercise name is Girl Shifter Link. Okay, you will see this dimension now. Okay, let's start make a 3D modeling and SolidWorks. Let's start. Let's start from a front plan and click on normal tool at this plan click a sketch and I want to start from a line make a vertical line and give the smart dimension for a vertical line it is 100 100 millimeter and then I want to make a new line right click and make a one more right click and give the digits from the other one to one other for this one it is 15 millimeter a uh, 15 degrees and at this one sorry cool. delete this and this one it is a uh, 30 degrees and then click ok and I want to add a circle to this line And it is, uh, I want to trim, trim entities, make sure it is a power trim, and I want to delete more, and then click OK. For the next step, I want to trim this line too, okay, you will see, the sketch will like this, and I want to add a three point arc slot from this point to this point by click okay I want to give a smart dimension for this one it is 15 point eight millimeter and then click OK on modify box for the next step I want to add a three point arc slot more and I want to give a smart mention and it is as a radius 15 millimeter and then click OK Okay, you will see the sketch like this. For the next step, I want to add a horizontal line and vertical line and horizontal line too. And I want to give a smart dimension for this line. It is a 30 millimeter. And I want to click OK. And this one, it is 70 millimeter. And for the other line, or horizontal, this one, it is 30 millimeter. Okay. For the next step, I want to click a um, point and make it at this position and I want to give a smart dimension for distance it is 30 okay 
and I want to make a circle and give to this one for the next step and I want to add line from this point and meet to this point right click and click select and let's a trim to this line by click trim icon okay for the next step add offset entities and press and hold the control button at your keyboard and select to the sketch and make it a reverse and set a value on the dialog box it is a 10 millimeter and click OK and connect line okay you will see the sketch will like this for the next step I want to I want to lengthen to this line by click a trim entities make it is uh, make sure it is a power trim on your select press and hold left click and make it to this one click OK at the cushion and this one too okay let's delete to this line by drag your mouse okay click OK for the next step I want to to make this I want to delete to this uh, line by press and hold the control button on your keyboard and select to this line and right click and choose a delete make yes to all okay and I want to delete this one too right click and delete yes okay let's make a uh, isometric view by press and hold ctrl 7 at your keyboard and I want to make a thickness to this sketch by click a feature and extrude was okay for to make a thickness make sure select a midpoint mid plane and select to this one it is it is a uh, 60 millimeter and you can click to this position you will see the preview will like this and then click ok okay click to this toggle and click the sketch go to extrude was or extrude base select the sketch mid pen and set a value it is uh, the value it is 10 millimeter for the thickness and click OK for the sketch make a same to click a sketch extrude was or extrude base click this one and make it a mid plan and set the value 16 millimeter and then click OK okay And I want to add a fillet to this position and this one too. By click to this line and make a fillet and set the value is 25 millimeter. And click OK. Let's make to the other one. By click this one and make a fillet. Make sure that 25 five millimeter and click OK okay you will see the part will like this 
for for the next step i want to make a extrude cut to this position by click this surface and make a reference geometry and plan make the position for the reference plan it is a 30 millimeter and make sure change the direction to to inside the part and then click ok change the view by right click and go to normal tool and click the sketch and line I wanted to get a uh, for construction line right click select and change the smart dimension give it this uh, 25 millimeter and then click ok and I want to add a circle click to this point and give the dimension it is 12.5 millimeter and the next step click the circle more and make a smart dimension set a value 30 millimeter okay let's make a line I want to add from this point and you can follow to this step okay and click trim entities to delete this line okay you will see and then click OK and give the extrude was to give this thickness from this sketch and I want to set a value it is 10 millimeter and then click OK okay for the next step I want to extrude cut to this to this position and this one too by click the surface and go to normal tool and click the sketch click a line I want to start from this spot okay give the smart dimension for this one it is it is 20 and then click ok and we can give a and we can give a exit cut it's run about 9.5 millimeter okay, let's let's see the preview and click OK for the next step and I want to make a hollow in this position by click the surface and go to normal tool and click the sketch select the circle just make a circle and give the smart dimension for this circle it is 4.8 millimeter and click ok give the distance for this circle from its center it is 6 0.5 millimeter and click OK. 
and to this one from the vertical it is five millimeter and click OK at the modify box click OK and I want to make it and I want to extract cut this one and set value it is and set value it is six point four for a dip okay for the next step let's I want to hide this plane by click hide Okay, let's make a exit cut to this surface by click on normal tool and click a sketch and sector rectangle. Make from this point. And give the smart dimension for this white it is six millimeter and give and give the deep 9.5 millimeter by click of features and exit cut set 9.5 5 millimeter okay for a finishing at the at this part we can make it a fillet by click this one with press and hold the control button and click a fillet set a value it is three millimeter and you will see the preview will like this and I want to select this one too okay and then click OK go to the symmetric view if you want to change the appearance I want to click on uh, edit appearance for this sorry for this part I want, I want to make it so plain white and make it at the appearance I wanna change it is to metal steel maybe brass steel okay I want to select to this one color maybe add this one and click OK ok guys finally the part is done you can see all the preview will like this if you like this video you can like and support this channel 
at last see you next time thank you